So here I am in North Vancouver, and I'm at the top of the newly refurbished Ned's Atomic Dustbin Trail. This used to be a very janky, pretty much a creek bed type trail. And they've completely refurbished it with a lot of new soil and woodwork. And this will be my first time riding it. It just opened about two or three weeks ago. So uh, it's going to be brand new for me. So let's go Ripper. So I haven't ridden this trail in about three or four years. The last time I rode it, it was a pretty janky, gnarly, classic North Shore trail. And it discouraged a lot of people from getting here because of how janky it was. Yeah, I'm doing a fairly slow roll because, oh, that's rollable. So this is way bermier than it used to be. But it still has its jank. Yikes. Oh, here's the bridge. Yeah, beautiful aluminum bridge. So this trail is quite controversial because a lot of people like the classic old jank, old shore. And they don't like it kind of made so much more rideable. But the North Shore has so many janky trails that really need something a little more rideable. I kind of like the jank, but sometimes the North Shore is a little extreme. The other thing is this is a very hard to access trail. Either this is big 500 meter climb up from the parking lot or you shuttle to the top of CBC and you ride CBC and then down here in sequence. Which is probably the more desirable thing to do if you've got a second vehicle. But today I'm on my own so I did the climb. Oh yeah. So it's still, even though they smoothed it out, it's still a very janky trail. And uh, some people were claiming, complaining that it's no longer a black, it's kind of like a blue. Well, I wouldn't agree with that. This is definitely still a black. Oh yeah, that's a tough little sequence in there. But look at all this rock work. It's so beautiful. And it, man hours that go into this. Lots. Kudos to the 
North Shore Mountain Biking Association here for fabulous work. Oops. Two lines there, that's cool. Yeah, I would like to, oops. Gotta try that. Oh yeah. Yeah, I would like the North Shore Mountain Biking Association to embrace these ideas of optional lines. Some regions have really taken advantage of that where there's not necessarily an easy ride about, but two options, a hard and a harder. So those that are on a black can actually try the occasional double black feature. And to have some of the features progressive in that, for example, gap jumps or drops get progressively harder. And so you can kind of work an easy, easier way into something that might actually be quite scary to ride. Nice berm. Okay, so I can see that the trail is still being worked on. Okay, I gotta ride that. There we are, done. Well, I made for a pretty fun ride. That's a great trail. I'm uh, really impressed with how they've refurbished that trail. It's no longer the janky thing that they used to have, and it's rideable for way more people than it used to be. The only problem I would say is the access, as I mentioned before, but uh, fabulous trail. Kudos to the trail builders for doing a fabulous job. And thanks for watching, folks, and we'll see you next time.